Hi guys, in this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to enhance your layout using Invisible Red Toner for the Rico 5th Color Station. Now with our InDesign document already open, you can see we have a layout in mind. Now in this layout, we'll be applying the Invisible Red Toner to the shark graphic over the illustration. Now before we get started, we'll have to create a new spot color. To do that, go to the top right corner of your color palette and click New Color Swatch. We'll name the color swatch IVR, capital I, lowercase v, capital R. The color type will be Spot. The color mode will be CMYK. As for the indicator color, we'll use 50% magenta and 50% yellow, but you can use anything you want. Once you click OK, you'll see the IVR spot color is now in your color palette. Now as for the density, we want to keep this at 100%. Modifying this will only reduce the effect of the IVR toner, and that's not what we're looking for. Alright, select the shark graphic, and then click IVR to assign the color. Now to make sure the illustration underneath the shark graphic gets printed as well, with the shark graphic still selected, make sure you click Overprint Fill. That's located in your attributes panel if you don't see it. Now to confirm the overprint is set up correctly, Navigate to View on the toolbar and select Overprint Preview. If set up correctly, the shark graphic will look like it's multiplied over the fish illustration. With that confirmed, we're ready to export our PDF. Go to File, Export, or use the shortcut Apple E. We'll save this as an Adobe PDF. We'll use the Adobe PDF preset PDFX4. And if you want to add any crops or bleeds, now's the time to do that. Now with our PDF exported, we'll open it up to confirm the presence of the IVR 5th color toner. If you don't see print production in the far right panel, you can click on Tools in the toolbar, navigate down to Protect and Standardize, and add print production to that panel. All right, now click on print production, then click on output preview. This will open up a panel and display all the separations in the layout. You can see in the spots plate section, there's an IVR swatch listed. Now I find it handy to click on and off a few times to make sure that the swatch is properly displayed in all areas. Now you can also mouse over the fifth color artwork to confirm exactly how much toner coverage you're getting. And in this case, anything less than 100 will affect the overall impact when printed. Now that we've confirmed the fifth color is properly formatted, we're ready to print our file. Enjoy!